pi. We're going to look at some fractions, multiplying and dividing this time. Um, these are dead easy, alright? The multiplying fractions. Right, are you ready for this? Dead easy. Times the top, times the bottom. Right, 3 times 2, 6. 5 times 4, 20. Done, yeah? 3 times 2, 5 times 4, done. Simplify it, 2 goes into both, 2 goes in 3 times, 2 goes in 10 times. Hello, we're done, alright? Easy. Another example, again, it's the same thing. 4 times 1, 4. 7 times 8, 56. Simplify it, 2 goes into both, 2 over 28. 2 goes into both, 1 over 14. We're laughing. <laughs> yeah, easy. Right, now this one's a little bit harder because we're dividing. But there's only one thing you've got to remember. One thing, and it's flip reverse it. Because we rewrite the question, 4 over 7, reverse the sign, and flip the fraction. So we flip reversed it. <clears throat> and then, same again, 4 times 8, 32. 7 times 1, 7. Now, if you want, you can write that as a mixed number. <clears throat> How many 7s go into 32? How many 7s do go into 32? 4. Remainder 4. And we're working with 7. So 4 and 4 7s. I hope that's right. I think it is. Do another example, so remember, flip reverse it, so we've got <coughs> 6 over 11, reverse, flip, uh, and then times it, 6 times 3, 18, 11 times 2, 22, 2 goes into both, uh, 9 over 11, we're done, easy. <coughs> the last one, I've got two examples, 5 8 times 4. And the only thing here we've got to remember that 4 as a fraction can be written as 4 over 1. <clears throat> any whole number, any integer is written over 1. So times the top, times the bottom. 20 over 8. Simplify it. 10 over 4. Simplify it. 5 over 2. Simplify it. That's two and one half. Done. And it's just the same over here. <clears throat> so rewrite the question first. Six over eleven divided by five over one. The one rule we've got to remember for that: flip reverse it. So let's do that. Move our way, please. Thank you. Six over eleven times by one over five, and that gives you six over fifty-five. And that is it. That is how to multiply and divide fractions. Oh, that's a sellout.